Hey, what is up guys? As you can see, I have my Galaxy Note right here and today I'm going to be doing a like not a review as you can say my personal experience with CyanogenMod 10.1.3 which is a stable version for the Galaxy Note right now. So, uh, I've been using like the CyanogenMod 10.1.3 for like 2 days and here are the results. But before beginning, I'll stop for like 5 seconds. You you have the time to like the video and subscribe to my channel because I'm really hyper right now. So, anyways, let's get started. No, still. Did you subscribe? No? You need to subscribe right now. Go ahead and subscribe. So, let's continue, guys. So, as I told you, I'm using the Cyanogen Mod 10.1 from like two days now. And it's pretty much good. It doesn't uh, like have any lag like the previous how to say, Night Live versions and the test versions of the Cyanogen Mod 10.1. And as I uh, as, it, as it is written in the description that uh, it is a video for how to install too. So guys, the link is in the description. I have another video of installing like Cyanogen Mod 10.2. Like it's all the same procedure for installing every Cyanogen Mod on this phone. So it's basically useless of making a video like that of like showing every new versions of uh, installing Cyanogen Mod with the same process. So uh, the difference is like you you have to download the stable version instead of the like the nightlight version and just install with the same procedure it will work. So guys let's continue. Um, like uh, let me show you that it's the Android 4.2.2 uh, and it's uh, you can see it's Android 4.2.2 right here. Let me focus. Yeah, as you can see it's Android 4.2.2. And if you go down, uh, you can see it's written Cyanogen Mod 10.1.3, Galaxy Note GTN 7000. And if it was the uh, Nightlight or the, a test version, it would have been written right here. So, as you can see, it's the stable version right now. And that's a really good thing for us, the Galaxy Note users, because the phone is like two years old and uh, it's still getting, you know... I don't think it will get any further update more like for more than 4.1.2 from Samsung officially but we have the Sanjay Mod team thanks to you a lot uh, I wish there was a way of thanking Sanjay Mod but there isn't so anyways guys uh, the thing, my the final review is the, this is just a short video so my final review is the Sanjay Mod 10.1.2 10.1.3 excuse me is really good and like you know you can use it as your daily base drone because it's stable and I didn't face any you know how to say um, any bugs or something like that in the last like two days or some last in last from last two days so guys uh, the final conclusion is it's really good ROM. Go ahead. If you want to try it, go ahead and follow the procedure. The video link is in the description. Go ahead, follow it, uh, install it on your GTN 7000 and enjoy the stable version. And if you have a Galaxy S3, it's out uh, for the Galaxy S3 too. And the procedure is same. So you just need to download the G apps as, it, as shown in the previous video. I mean the link in the description video. And you need to download the Sanogen Mod 10.1 file and just flash it it's in the video so go ahead follow the video f and don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel guys again guys okay see you